but they've just been getting worse like oh these cystic ones I just Hey guys and welcome back. If we haven't met yet, my name is Madison Don't and I am not your typical acne sufferer. So acne really chose the wrong person to mess with because not only am I a science graduate who is obsessed with research, but I am also a biology teacher. So I was going to make damn sure that I taught everybody the solution once I found it myself. My struggles and the struggles of some of my other family members has also motivated me to go back to uni a third time and study naturopathy, AKA natural medicine. So I am also constantly learning every day more and more about the body's natural ability to heal itself. Today's video is going to be a lead on from my acne story video that I posted last week. So I will link that one up the top here and also down in the description below. But that video shared some very vulnerable before and after photos. And I also explained to you what did work and what didn't work for me along my acne journey. The footage coming up in this video was actually also supposed to be in the acne story video last week. However, it was way too long. So I had to split it up. Um, and for that reason, the footage in this video will actually be back from that same day. But enough of me rambling. Let's get into it. Here is my full biology BD serum review with all the details. So this is my face now. That one's so painful. Probably looks painful. So any of the flashback videos that you see of me when I actually have acne and I'm talking about what I've done, they are from that six week mark. So I didn't intend to really show anyone that video. So I just kind of wanted to do a journal so that I could track what exactly I was doing and what was helping and what was not helping. I didn't know if I was ever going to show it to anybody, um, let alone did I know that I was going to have a YouTube channel and I was going to share it with everybody. Now you remember that I said I went to the doctor on the 3rd of February. Well, on the 31st of January, I fell victim to influencer marketing, or at least I thought I had. I bought this basically before I went to the doctor, maybe like the end of January. I think I came upon it by an influencer and that sounds stupid. I know because influencers like, things don't necessarily work. I did so much research and all the reviews from every single website were amazingly positive. I was up until all hours of the night researching, read through their thousands of reviews and they have heaps of reviews. Like I would not be surprised if I read every single one of them back then. Like, and in typical me fashion, I looked for scientific articles. Um, there wasn't much on Davidson plum, which is the main active ingredient in BD serum. Um, but I did find one article that pretty much just showed a list of berries that um, had antioxidants and it said that Davidson Plum um, had more than blueberries. So that's pretty much all I found. But yeah, the reviews and just all the research that I'd done um, online and the before and after photos, it really looked like it was good stuff. So I bought it on the 31st of January. Um, it wasn't cheap. It was $98, um, which is probably the most expensive beauty product that I've bought that I can think of right now. Like it probably is. And yeah, I really thought that it was going to work. Um, but I just wanted to wait until my doctor's appointment just to see what he thought because yeah, I didn't want to start applying something to my skin that was going to make it worse. But obviously when I went to the doctors, then he gave me that whole other plan. So that's what I ended up doing. And I ended up putting the BD serum to the side for the first couple of weeks. After a couple of weeks, I just got really doubtful um, and I was like, yeah, maybe they just paid the influencers to say that and maybe it's all just like fake reviews and I don't know. So I decided that I was going to send it back. But I was like, those reviews, they're too good to be true. Um, like there's way too many good ones that say that it's like the new miracle product. Surely if it was the new miracle product, I would have heard more about it. There were only two bad reviews on this that I found that um, said that they made their acne worse 
but then they could have been talking about the purge stage. And so I emailed them and I asked if I could send it back. It wasn't opened or anything. Um, and they said yes, but they said that it would have to be for an exchange. But there was no other products on the website that I wanted to spend $98 on. So I just figured that I was kind of stuck with it um, and that okay, well, there's nothing else that I'd get, so I might as well try it um, because what else have I got to lose? So at the six week mark, I decided that I wasn't happy with what we were doing so far. So I decided to stop using uh, the Cetaphil moisturizer and I stopped using EpiDuo and I started using the BD serum. But I think I've decided that I want to start this because this week I've been getting the big cystic ones back again and I haven't been doing anything wrong. I've still been exercising and eating healthy and no dairy and it's like, and taking all my pills, I have not missed one. I take so many supplements. Now I watched all the FAQs on the biology website um, and they said that because it is such an active ingredient, usually you start off by using it a couple times a week and then you work up to once a day and then eventually you're doing it twice a day, so morning and night. What I did is I did it, I think at night time for the first two days. And then by the third day, um, it just felt really good on my skin after all the drying treatments, it was so hydrating. So by the third day I was using it morning and night and I've been doing that ever since. So I can confidently say that influencer marketing is not all bad and some of them can be trusted. I think the lesson from this is not to avoid what influencers are promoting, but just to do your own research and to be smart about it. I'm actually really curious as to whether you've heard of biology. Um, so let me know it down in the comments if you've heard of it or if you've tried it um, and yeah, what you've thought about it. <laughs> they look so painful in the viewfinder. They are. So here are my results with biology. As you can see, the cysts have disappeared, the inflammation reduced significantly, my skin and scars look brighter, and all round I began to feel confident again and smile. So I still use biology after my cleanser every day, morning and night. And as you can see, I am almost onto my third bottle. So I've still got a little bit left in that one, but I still very much love it. Although it's not as cheap as the other drugstore products that I used to buy, Getting rid of my acne and getting my confidence back has been absolutely priceless. And when I think about it, I would have just spent that money somewhere else, trialing different products and treatments and going crazy, just trying to find something else that finally worked. Since my acne story video went live last Sunday, Biology has actually messaged me after watching it themselves and they were so impressed by the results that I achieved with their product that they wanted to give more people the opportunity to try out its incredible powers themselves. To make it more accessible for you to try out, they have actually given me a code to pass on for 15% off that I will pop up on the screen now. Remember, sometimes you just have to take that leap of faith and invest in yourself. And as you can see, I'm on my third bottle. So my leap of faith has definitely had its rewards. Now I've just spoken about influencers and sponsorship in this video. So I did want to reiterate that number one, I'm not an influencer. I have 70 subscribers. And number two, biology actually messaged me after I'd posted that video and after I'd already given my full honest review of their incredible product. So at least for now, that code that I've given you is solely just for you. I don't even earn any commission out of it anyway. Rest assured with this channel that I know what it's like to struggle and to be confused about what products to use. So I will never ever partner with a brand that I don't 100% believe in. To me, money is not worth sacrificing what this channel stands for, and that is honest and educational content for young women who are struggling with their health. Hopefully this video helped you if you were thinking about looking into biology. The root cause of my acne was my hormones, but biology helped me significantly with just calming and clearing my acne so that I could even start thinking about getting off the pill. If you have any questions about biology at all, then please do not hesitate to find me over on Instagram and send me a message. But anyway, that is it from me today. I look forward to chatting to you throughout the week on my Instagram and I will see you next Sunday for my next video. I can help you out. I can